Can we can we stop going backwards? Can we please stop going backwards with this stupid front office and this stupid freaking team? You know, like, you know, I was streaming with, you know, Philly 500 joined the stream. It was great and everything. And we talked about Derek Barnett. And then all of a sudden, like, this this came out. Two-year deal for Derek Barnett. You have got to be, you've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. Okay, two sacks last year. Two sacks. He led the defensive ends with eight penalties last year. He had more penalties than sacks. A first-round bust, 14th overall pick, one good year, okay, and always hurt. And hurting us more than helping us with his stupid penalties. Remember when Nick Sirianni was on the sideline and saying it's always him? This guy always has penalties. What gave him an extension? This free agency has been a total waste. More flexibility, somewhat more cap, somewhat more draft picks, and still you go out and you're going backwards. They're not trying to get to a championship. They're not trying to rebuild. You're going half-assed backwards with a move like this. Okay? Like, what? Why? Like, like didn't we learn from last year about Derek Barnett? I mean, what led to this? Obviously, Derek Barnett had no interest in free agency, which I'm not surprised. So a two-year deal, how much, I don't know, hasn't been updated yet. So what does this mean now? The Eagles, it means that the Eagles are not going after edge rusher in this draft. One of two things is going to happen. Either the Eagles are going after a quarterback or the Eagles are going to draft a defensive tackle. Devontae Wyatt's on a pre-draft visit. Jordan Davis on a pre-draft visit. That's all I've seen so far as of right now. So take edge rusher off of that off of the list. No more edge rushers are coming to Philly. But Derek Barnett, doubt if he's going to start, and I hope he doesn't. I would pick up Ojabo on a damn Achilles. Okay. I would pick up Ojabo on an Achilles and start him off of that injury more than having Derek Barnett on the field right now. Dirty enough that you drafted Derek Barnett. He had a strip uh, in the NFC Championship game. He recovered the fumble in the Super Bowl. It, it, this guy has been a complete headache. A complete headache. And it's just, it turned out to be like a really bad day. But no, we're going to go after Devontae Parker, a guy that's descending right now, and they're going to throw us a bone and try to go sign him. Great. Awesome. You signed Anthony Harris back. You locked up a bunch of players that was really important last year. Okay, you signed Boston Scott back. You signed, they're, they're not trying to go forward. They're trying to go backwards. This isn't a we're moving forward type move. He's going to be a more of a situation. Like Derek Burnett's going to be what? More of a situational type defensive end? Come on now, man. That This is, this is horrible. This is horrible. He sucks. I mean, it's already enough we're justifying these picks. We're justifying J.J. Ortega-Whiteside and, and, and Jalen Regalor right now. It's already enough they're trying to justify those picks, but now they're bringing Derek Barnett back of what I didn't even expect to happen? This is just one of the worst off-seasons, one of the worst moves. We had less cap, less draft picks, and we did more. We did <clears throat> we did more last year with less. We have more, we're doing less, and we're moving backwards at the same time. This guy pissed me off last year, and you know what? He's going to piss me off this year. And if you think that when the game's on the line, Derek Barnett's going to be some stupid idiot that's going to cause a stupid pe Eight penalties last year. Led all defensive ends last year. Howie Roseman size a three-year extension. And this, and this is what we get. This is what we get out of everything. I understand we had less cap space, but you could have you passed up on so I mean so I mean Jesus Christ. I'm telling you, it, it's it's just this. This freaking guy pisses me off so much 
pisses me off. He pit, he's looking at him piss. He mm, nah nah. Screw that. Take yourself off my screen. I you don't even deserve to be on this freaking video right now. Mm mm. I'm just I'm just I can't even. Uh, Howie Roseman, what what are you doing, man? What what are you doing? Like, are we going backwards? I want to hear. I I really want to hear that. Like, I, I really actually want to hear this. Like, why? We're better off without him. We're we're better off being one defensive end down for a game than having him on the field. I mean, that's that's critical. I mean, that's how bad he is. We don't we we don't deserve this. We we don't deserve this. They deserve this for making stupid decisions. Us fans don't deserve this crap. We don't. We don't deserve it. This is BS. That this is you're going backwards with this move. You're not you're not moving forward. You're not trying to build to another roster. I mean, what like what 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 in the right mind gets you to pick him to re-sign him to a two-year deal? You paid this guy ten million dollars last year for two sacks. Two. I don't know, bro. This offseason is going to give me. And on top of that, we don't know if they're getting a court. We don't even know what's going to happen. We don't even know the future of what's going on. We don't know the future of Jalen Hurts. We don't know if they're drafting a quarterback. We don't know if they're actually going to pick two top players in this draft with two first-round picks and trade one back. We don't even know what's going to happen. But this tells me right here it's going to be quarterback or they're going to go to get go defensive tackle for Jordan Davis and Devontae Wyatt. That's all I can really take out of this right now. So that's all I got to say, guys. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think. I, I, everyone's going to hate this anyway. If there's one person that like this move, I'd be shocked, okay? If it's towards more like a depth piece, I guess. But I, I just, he's just a cancer. I just don't want him here. He, can, he doesn't help us at all, period. He's not going to get a pass rush. He's, he's not. I'll see you guys later.